the memory card loaded up? Oh, you're not Irma. Hi. Good neighbor's crazy. Thefts, murders, worse. Sometimes you just gotta escape. Uh-huh. I guess. You ever listen to the Silver Shroud? Huh. That's what we need. Sure. That sounds familiar. You'd remember him if you heard his show. They're the best detectives. What if the Silver Shroud was real? With his... I got a plan to bring him to life. So we can fight bad guys and give the rest of us a symbol of something better. Sure, Kent. You have a plan, all right. I know how it sounds. I've built my own custom machine gun. Even better than the one in the show. But to make this work, I still need the most important piece. The genuine Silver Shroud costume herself. And they actually got one here in Boston. They made it for the TV show. Will you help? I might do it, if you make it worth my while. I can give you some caps up front. Just promise you- Right. As it happens, I already have your costume. There she is. Pretty as the posters. The Silver Shroud costume herself. And memorabilia, too? You're something else. Together with my gun, everything's all set. Here you go. After all these years, the Silver Shroud is born again. But there's just one problem. I'm just not Silver Shroud material. I could be Rhett Reinhardt, or, or his butler, Jarvi Blake. But the Shroud is strong, capable. That's the first sane thing you've said. Yeah, yeah. But I, I do have a better idea who should wear it. You up for being a Silver Shroud? You're just like him. Except you probably haven't been in a blimp shot down by mobsters. If I go along with this, I could use a little extra. If it'll get you to help, sure. I, I, I may be able to scrounge up a couple of things. Looks like I get to be the Shroud. The costume and gun are yours. So you patrol good neighbor's streets, and I'll call in any crimes on my radio station. Here's some calling cards, I guess. When you dispatch justice, leave them behind. That way, everyone knows the Silver Shroud has returned. Time to fight crime! the streets of Boston. One man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Calling all Silver Shroud fans. A once-in-a-lifetime announcement. The Silver Shroud returns and he's gonna clean up the streets. Everyone heard how Wayne Delancey m murdered Miss Selmy and her kid over a few lousy caps. Death is coming for you, Wayne. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging. What's with the, the fancy does? That guardian is looks expensive. the shroud. Might be Today's I found in, in the parlor of mysteries. Your crimes have gone unpunished for too long. Jasmine. What the hell's wrong with you? Chamomile. Well, nothing Pain. a few bullets won't cure. Ecstasy. You mess with me, you This can only be the death of mysteries. You reach around. I removed that scumbag slug, but you're sick with fever and still suffering. Mistress of mysteries, no. I'm all right. But the mayor... Fat Fatey, we stumbled upon a most sinister plot, old friend. Ha! <laughs> no, dear heart. The Shroud stumbled. The Mistress maneuvered. I knew of the Mayor's misdeeds for many days. I followed him to that fateful meeting with Fat Fatey. I was about to... Attention! Silver Shroud and Mistress of Mystery! This is Chief Corcoran of the Boston Police Department. We know you're in there. You are both wanted in connection with the murder of Mayor Murphy. Come out with your hands up. Hmm. It would seem that our leaving the scene of the Scale slaughter was terribly timed. Incurring the wrath of Boston's finest is an unfortunate and unexpected annoyance. Unexpected by... 
us, maybe. But perhaps not by Fat Fay. Ah, I'm starting to to see into his twisted plan. Ah, damn this gunshot wound. Look, heroes, we can clear this up. Come out now, unarmed. I'll be friend of the show. Jerry is here. Is this thing on? Hello. Hello. It's on. Holy moly, the silver shroud in the flesh. We're recording in oh, here. No. Death is coming for me. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> Great, great. The Silver Shroud's dispatched justice already. Miss Selby has been avenged. Shit, the Shroud off Wayne. Wait, so this guy's actually for real. sell some junk? Oh, you dead. better believe it. So, Jerry, go on. Tell the listeners about what we're talking about. Right. So, AJ, you know the chem dealer by Bobby's. He's doing good for himself. Says he's got a whole new market. Kids. Even with his garbage chems, he's just breaking in the caps. You hear that? Sounds like the Silver Shroud has another bad guy to deal with. Uh, why? This Shroud guy, he's gonna muscle in on the chem trade now? No. He's gonna do something about it. AJ's selling the kids. Keep your hands These chems have can see killed it. people. Hey. And? Look at the clown. I don't get it. This is my turf, clown. I can't let And AJ I don't kill appreciate kids. what you call them. Whatever. Peddling poison to kids, are we? Today, you face the Silver Shroud! Uh... <laughs> who you say? Oh, crazy. You can't put you up to this? He keeps moaning about the poor little kids. What the hell, right? Tell you what. I'll pay you... Let's say 50 caps just to shut up about it. And, uh... Maybe get Kent off my back. Come on, All right? It's right For 50 caps? Eat. No way. All right, fine. Make it 75. Oh, a lousy geez, 25 oh, caps more? Are you trying to insult me? Hey, 75 is a gift. The... Paul, All right, fine. I'll give you 90 if you just leave me in goddamn peace. You don't understand. How much are you willing to pay to keep breathing, pal? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, e easy there. I got friends, powerful friends. And yeah, but we can deal. Call it uh, 200 caps and just walk away. We all come out ahead. Nobody goes to the bone house. All right, the skirt can stay, but hand over the caps here, and don't show your face around here again. The Silver Shroud infiltrating. The Silver Shroud's bringing justice to good neighbor. You bad guys better look out. And now, a special update. The villainous assassin Kendra was recently spotted at the third rail. The same Kendra who bombed little Joe Shack and killed four innocent drifters. If you want to see the Silver Shroud in action, stay near Whitechapel Charlie. The Shroud's sure to interrogate him to find the evildoer's whereabouts. Galaxy! Radio. Hancock says newcomers are when evil walks the streets of Austin. One Go man lurks in. in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode is into Shroud the robot's costume? den. Charlie, my way for Did paying customers. That's all of them. Fat fiends, mob bots, have been sent back to the mechanical hell. That's you look them. upon the silver yes, shroud. I seek a miscreant no. named Kendra. Shroud, then. For he himself not, presents Kendra is not himself. one to be trifled Someone with. Else is People associated with her have a habit of being found face down right. in a ditch. But who, if you're set on meeting her, mistress of mysteries, you and I have battled Boston's Rose Gallery. Can you spare a few details on her at least? This. On the house? You got to have finesse to be an assassin. Kendra's a murderer. But Very skilled murderer. Listen, mate, the combat scan shows you know what you're about. Save your cats by a logger instead. You don't know anything. 
It is not wise to stand between the silver shroud and righteous justice. Justice? You mean to end her? In that case, if that's just south of Good Neighbor, walk the street apartments. Yep, for the blighters she's got with her. Nasty piece of business, then. Good luck. You shot me a good shroud. But I still got my kisser, see? And I'm gonna use it to tell you where the big boss man is, see? And you're one. Condition. Going down. Feel that? <laughs> you 
You must be Kendra. And you. You're the crazy one in the costume. Wayne Delancey's killer. You have no idea who you're dealing with. I do so like it when the little bug crawls willingly into the spider's webs. You have taken your last life, villain. You stole my line. <laughs> update. No, it wasn't Bobby No-Nos who offed AJ and his goons. It was the Silver Shroud. See his calling card if you don't believe me. Now's our time, listeners. Justice is coming a good neighbor. You'll see. Galaxy News Radio. the streets of Boston. One man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode, The Mechanist Unmasked. Very bad people may be coming. It's not safe here. <clears throat> please, don't come any closer. I don't know you. Just, just go away. Another headliner. Hancock seeks a special meeting with our hero, the Silver Shroud. Whatever it's about, be careful, Shroud. We're all with you. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode, a slaying in Scully's. By himself, accepted by everyone. Guess what someone tells me? Some costume freak is operating in Good Neighbor. And the kicker is, it ain't me. How should I feel about this? This neighborhood is ill. I am the cure. You're priceless. Like the Silver Shroud himself walked out of a comic book in the light den. Just priceless. You've been busy scaring people, bashing in a few faces. I respect that, so far. But I gotta ask, one freak to another, why the getup? Many have sought to pierce the Shroud to no avail. You just don't stop. Stay you, pal. The lowlifes you took out 
all belong to the same asshole, and that asshole's planning some old-fashioned revenge on you. You dig? Fortunate for you, I want Sinjin to take a dirt nap. He's taken two Bit Raider outfits and made them scary. Small fish now, but if left alone... He will be judged for his crimes. Trust me, he needs a lot of judging. Got a lead on two of his own. Smiling Kate and Northy. Smiley is gathering a posse to take you out. And Northy is just running scared. Hired himself some goons and is holding up in prospect. Just keep piling those body bags up until you find the location of the big guy himself. Getting rid of Sinjin helps you too. Some appreciation is in order. I'm doing you the favor, pal. Sinjin's got a powerful hate of brewing. But you deal with Sinjin, and I'm inclined to show you some gratitude. You feel me? the boy behind the costume. You've been really naughty, Mr. Shroud. Making all my friends so nervous with your calling cards. Taking out Sinjin's favorite toy soldiers. But now it's time to rip your goddamned heart out! <laughs> Out the Institute. Hey. And just like that, the Institute was gone in a puff of smoke. Thanks to the Minutemen. this 
Hey, times. over here. You think you'll be any different? Oh, it's you. Oh, Sugar. I told Kent all that hero stuff was going to get you both killed. Oh, God. Oh, God. Calm yourself. The Shroud is here to help. Please, stop. That's what got Kent into trouble in the first place. A dozen raiders barged in and snatched him. When they took him away, they left you a message. Just listen to Kent's radio station. It keeps playing it over and over again. She won't be... What? Oh, God! What's happening? On your knees, dirtbag! What? What are you doing? What? Ah! Sinjin, all clear. This is the Shroud's headquarters. So you must be the Silver Shroud's little friend. Yes. If you want to see your friend alive, Shroud, meet me at Milton General Hospital. Don't do it, Shroud. It's a trap. Save yourself. Ah! Oh! Oh my God! Do it, Shroud! Do it! On my knee! Ah! Tick tock, Shroud. Don't keep me waiting. We got business that needs finishing. Here's a Silver Shroud update.
Vargas. Disappearing at huh? Uh. Time's up. Grenade! Say it again. Hold, assholes. Anyone turns heel, I'm coming for you and your family. And you, Shroud. You step any closer, of them now. and we get to see what's inside Kent's head. You shield yourself behind an innocent. You are craven, Sinjin. And you shall fall before me. Don't talk to me like that. Some of these losers think you're some sort of legend. Like you walk straight out of a comic book. But you and I know, you're human. And you're weak. You came here and for what? You little sidekick? I have cut a path through all your thugs. Who can truly say I'm not the Shroud? Don't listen, man. He's a phony. So what's gonna happen is this. I'm going to kill Kent. Then we're gonna shoot the hell out of you. Nothing's gonna be left but paste. Then, I'm going to good neighbor and kill every last worthless bastard there and burn the whole thing down. No one screws with Sinjin. What happens is this. Everyone that points a gun at me dies. Every last one. Jesus. Sinjin can't do anything to us if he's dead. Cowards! <laughs> Kent. I've never been so happy to see anyone in my entire life. Are you alright? My leg is killing me. But it could have been so much worse. I just give up. On all of it. Crime fighting just isn't what I thought it'd be. Really? After all this, you're just giving up? I knew it was bad out there. But this? I don't even think the Silver Shroud himself could fix this disaster area. If you just quit, then the bad guys have already won. You... you're right. But I'm tired. I just want to go home. I'm going back to Good Neighbor. Really, thanks for saving me. But I'm just done. Kent. I just need time to recover, you know? Hey. <laughs> <coughs> 
Come. I don't want to die. Neighbor ain't good enough for you? Go check out Covenant. Heard that place is all kinds of fit. A new player and good neighbor. Hello, little pawn. Welcome to our fun and games. The deed is done. The dreaded Sinjin breathes no more. All by your lonesome, you took down the big bad Sinjin. Hmm. We I just need time to recover. Tight rope of you know? One more day. Take this for the effort. You played your part in serving justice to those most deserving of it. I'm gonna miss these little conversations. Ah, Ken, my man. Why the long face? You got what you wanted. I was t tortured. Almost died. It's not like the radio plays at all. Hey, who hasn't been tortured from time to time? The price of throwing down with the man is always a few scars. Pick yourself up. Good neighbor's just a bit safer thanks to the two of you. What would the Shroud be without his faithful friend, Red Reinhardt? This... this means a lot to me. I'm gonna need some time to heal, you know? But then I got a special project in mind, just for you. I'll fire up my radio station if I make any progress. Mayor Hancock? Too bad about Finn. I'm gonna miss him next Super Mutant attack rolls round. Oh well. What can I do for our newcomer? 